Hello and welcome to Loop Lounge. I'm David Clark, and today we're going to be looking at remix decks and making your own unique ones from existing packs. We just need to do a couple of things before we get started. We're going to choose whatever remix sets we want and we're going to make a copy. I'll show you the reason why. Firstly, right click on any pack you want, go to Export Remix Set, rename it, go to Desktop, and hit Save. Once that's exported, find the .trak file and drag it back into the collection. You can rename it if you want, or you can just leave it. I'm just gonna call it Loops Lounge Trial. That will then load up. And the reason why we do this is because we are actually moving or removing files from existing packs to make a new one. So you need a backup as to not interfere with the original. For example, I've done one earlier, so if I just load this, you'll actually see parts of the pack missing from the cells. And that's because we've moved them into another remix set. And secondly, before we start, go to Preferences, go to the Remix Deck section, and make sure Auto Save Edited Remix Sets is not ticked. Therefore, we can save it whenever we want. So let's go. Just drag in some files. Let's go there. Stick that one there. And what we're gonna do is just take whatever cell we want from any of these three remix sets, and drag them into the new remix set. It is as easy as that. But that's it. Let's have a go. Okay, let's have another go. Click and drag, that's all. Let's take some of this, bit more percussion, and let's have static. That is essentially it. That is all you have to do to make your own remix sets from taking other ones from packs. One more cool thing you can do is you can record effects and automation on the loop recorder and drag that in as well. I think you'll like this. Now once that's recorded, we can just drag that from the loop recorder directly into an empty cell. But if you want to get away from the computer, you can go onto your F1 and we can capture it from there. Just hold capture and turn the knob until it says CL, that's L for loop recorder. Then press capture and then just select an empty cell. Hit capture again and you're ready to go. With that technique, you can truly make remix decks your own. When you want to save, just stop your deck, click the letter of the deck, hit save remix set, and you can rename it whatever you want. Hit rename, and you see it instantly in the file, and you can even export it. This just shows what you can do with remix sets, from existing ones to making your own. You can make anything you want if you just put your mind to it.